McPherson, wake up. I've got to talk to you. I found you a little upper. Take this. The killer must be preparing something, but what? You should interview him to find out. McPherson, we can't stay here. We have to find a way to escape. Escape? Excellent idea, Hernandez. Way to take the initiative. I unscrewed the ventilation grate to escape from my cell. See if you can do the same. The shaft is welded shut. Impossible to get out that way. You've studied the killer's psychological profile. Do you have an idea what he might use as a code for the door? I've got the code for the shelter hatch. Is that what you're looking for? No. I need a digital code to open a cell door. It doesn't ring a bell. But it could be connected with the list of names I saw in a file. On the list, your name was associated to the name Martin. Mine was associated with Stanton. The killer could have used that to devise a code. Hurry up and get me out of here. I don't want to die here. Thanks for pulling me out of there, Hernandez. So, you can make yourself useful when absolutely necessary. There's a man locked up in the other cell. He was the one who gave me the amphetamines. He says he knew one of the victims, Susan. He might be able to help us. It's just that he seems pretty disturbed. If he's been here for a while, I'm not surprised. to resort to this. I notices the disappearance of all these cops. They'll send agents after us, right? Have you found a lead on the killer's identity? For now, I know his name, but not his face. Doesn't make any difference. We need to concentrate on surviving, not on whether or not he's got a mustache. I think Hawker's dead. The killer got him. The fact that he's not shut up in here with us is not a good sign. As long as I haven't seen a body, there's hope he's still alive. I'm not so sure about Garrus, though. I have a hard time believing he could have avoided falling into the killer's clutches. That sicko out there. Has he talked about his plans? Not really. 
and I'm not sure I want to know. Do you have a plan to get us out of here? We're gonna have to implement. Stay on your toes, stay alone. You're the one the killer drugged. Thanks for the pills. Got some of my energy back. I'm gonna try and get you out of here. I've had nothing to eat for days. I'm starving. I might be able to help you out with that. Here's some gingerbread. It should ease your hunger a little. Have you talked to Susan Girelli? Yes. The killer abducted her shortly after locking me up. He murdered her. Poor Susan. She was so beautiful. So sensitive. Did you know her before her abduction? We had an affair. Now she's dead. And soon we will be too. If you've been here for a while, perhaps the killer has revealed some of his plans? Megalomaniacs love to boast. Don't underestimate him. He doesn't talk without a reason. I wouldn't make the mistake of underestimating him. I know we're dealing with a master of manipulation. He didn't say anything to me just that he intended to settle some outstanding issues. How did you end up here? Are you from around here? I found the house while I was hunting in the woods. My name is Gary. I have a farm near Ashland. Are you Gary Anderson? The county sheriff was investigating your disappearance. I, I thought you were dead. He took me by surprise in the house. I don't know why he didn't kill me right away. I would have been better off. We're gonna try and find a way to get you out of here. It's impossible to escape. There's no hope. We have to get out of here. I don't want to die here. Sealed. Hey, where are you going? Wait for me, I'm coming with you. I think you better stay here. Bar the doors. I'll come back to get you. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna see if there's a way out. And there's a computer in the lab. I might be able to make contact with the outside world. All right. I'll keep both doors secured so the killer can't get in. Good. I'll be back. Leave the porch light on. could be anywhere. Thank you. 
should never have made you come here. Hmm. Something's buried here. It's a mine. The blinking light indicates that it's armed. It looks like a pressure release mine. If I step on it and then remove my foot, bam. There's no way to defuse this thing. But I might be able to neutralize it by leaving something heavy on it. Use it to neutralize a mine. There's absolutely no doubt about it. It's a landmine. Seems to be coming from the grating. <laughs> 